Gen fans, welcome back to another episode of Empyrean Galactic Survival. This is your host, Zelot, and I'm here today doing the Ultimate Iron Man Competition Season Zero. It's kind of the inaugural test season, and we're, even if we die, we're going to continue to play along. Hopefully everyone will anyway, but, uh, you know, time constraints, whatever. Anyway, I haven't actually died yet, so well, not, you can't really see there. Um... Yeah, so I'm on Gornanal, Gornanal orbit, where I put up my uh, space base, and we're here just uh, chilling and relaxing. I'm, I was in the middle of cleanup, and I realized that, you know, whew, I emptied, I, I'm just tired of cleaning. Now I want to go do something, I want to go do some adventuring, check out the planet. What I really need is a little bit more restroom Zascosium, so I think what we need to do is fix up the SV here. It got a little bit beat up by the look of it. Um, yeah, okay. I'm going to have to replace some blocks. I don't have a repair station yet because I don't have enough to make the console. I got I got a repair bay, but I don't have a con. I can't... I, I don't think I got enough to make the console. Okay, anyway. So it's just the one block by the look of it. Okay. <clears throat> okay, so let's get that made. So I have put most of my stuff now into the base. So I still got to clean out the CV. The CV is still packed with crap. We're not going to be taking the CV today. Uh, we're going to be taking the SV, and I've cleaned out the SV. So what we need today is a couple of hardened steel blocks for... Combat steel. See, that's HV only. It's kind of too bad, but that's okay. I guess you can't really have a flank tank without really affecting its flight capabilities. Um, okay, so let's make 10 of those for now. We'll just take them with us. And let's take a look at the stats while that thing's running. So the output is... 2.09 megawatts and with an advanced constructor running it's I don't know why it's kicking back and forth but I think it's one or two megawatts it looks like two, two megawatts so we're still going to charge a little bit while the advanced constructor is running um, I didn't do much in the way of gardening so I decided not to go full blown even though I do have like hundreds steel plots I think on the CV still I just did the some of them I did like four deep of each type for now of each type of yield not necessarily each type of sprout but uh, I I'm doing the I mean some of these I probably won't even use I'll pick them once and never use or something but um, stuff like the spice, the mushrooms, and the plant vegetable matter, um, that's going to go good. The grain will work for plastic too, so if I want to make some plastics. Um, and aloe, of course, for the healing. So we've got a couple of things going here. We can't make anything yet because we've got to grow the plants. So I think everything's ready to pick by the look of it. Um, we don't need anything right now. We'll come back to it. No, everything's not ready to pick. You know what? We'll come back to it. We don't need, we, we don't need the experience. We don't need the food right now. It's just good enough. Let's get going. Get this block in, get it repaired. Okay. I like doing a lot of my repair work and construction work with the drone. Oops. Uh, the reason being is you can get lower down than your um, guy can, and you can obviously look straight down at stuff. It's just easier if you're pulling a lot of blocks. You can you can pull more blocks with the um, with the drone. It seems, or at least it's easier to. Okay, so is that that one I think so yep okay 
So, I'm not going to bother painting it right now. I'm just going to repair up what we've got damaged and we'll get going. I got a bunch of ammo made. I've got some food. I've got lots of fuel and oxygen. Uh, this thing is completely empty of stuff, so we've got lots of cargo space. Uh, really what I need to do is, is suss out how much Zaskosium there is going to be on that planet because that's going to determine kind of what sort of CV I'm going to go for. Um, well, obviously a, a restroom in Zaskosium, but apparently there's a restroom in two places, so I should be able to find an asteroid of it or something. I know there was uh, somewhere else there's asteroids of it on... I can look here. What is it? It was... Um, is this it here? Yeah, a restroom. But I never did find it. So I'd have to go back there and really scout around, I guess. Um, 25 AU. So we haven't been to the alien outpost yet, and we're not going to be going there today. But we're going to go down to Gornanol and check out the surface of the planet. I know... Uh, it's not our next mission planet, it's the mission after our next mission, but I really need the ore, so, because I'm lacking repair station, I've got a repair bay, but I need to make the console, I don't have the Zaskosium right now for it, so, it's, I, I, I want the repair bay on my base here, I'm going to really need it, because this is just freaking annoying. Right? Okay. Okay. I think we've got most of it now. At least it's in ship shape again. Okay. Let's get going. It's cool out in space. As soon as you turn your jet back on, you can fly. No, I'm not in God mode. Trust me. I turn my jet back off and I will fall. Boom. Because of the gravity generator. Anyway, just wanted to point that out. <laughs> oh, actually, speaking of, let's here. Let's jump in, and I'm going to show you all the settings really quick. Although I, do, I, I guess it doesn't matter. It's not like it's a mission. It's not a mission. Who cares, right? Um, let's power this up. Okay. So, let's get ourselves all settled in here. Fuel all that up. We're going to go into our fridge and put this stuff away for now. Okay. <clears throat> We've got lots of O2, lots of fuel, lots of food. Potentially we can shoot some more food. And what what were we at for ammo here? Uh, over 11,000 bullets and 450 missiles. Or rockets, I should say. Guided rockets. Uh, so we're just going to come down into water here somewhere. Hang on, i got to turn down my uh, game audio here. It's a little extreme. Okay. And, oh god, it looked like I appeared over top of like a, the patrol vessel or something right off the bat. That was funny. Okay, so what do we got? We've got some... Some creepy crawly looking alien planet with like alien fog all the time. So, cobalt right off the bat. That's nice. So, let's suss out to see what this looks like. So, I'm not, I'm not worried about the cobalt. If, if I'm going to look at all the mushrooms, holy crap. 
It's like a mushroom forest. Okay. The water looks brown and creepy. And, oh, the water's broken there. Okay. That's fine. So it looks like there's potential seaweed in there, maybe. I don't know. Anyway, I don't really care. What we need to do is we'll just follow our radar for a bit here. Oh, actually, let's suss out. It has five Zascosium and 12 Arrestrim. Okay, okay, that might be enough. We'll have to see how big these uh, Zascosium deposits are. So we'll try and find one here. Ah, I think the gravity is kind of extreme here. Yeah, it's 1.2. Okay. Because I was noticing the uh, energy, the power consumption was higher than normal. On the ship. Okay. Well, let's keep following the radar. Stop looking at the, the alien landscape. Okay, so is this going to be like southwest then? Because we just came from the west. Well, I'm hoping... I'm hoping we can get enough of the high-end ore here, because I really don't feel like... Uh, making a new CB or at least modifying an old one. Runes, yay, nothing, who cares. Okay. So I guess this planet's going to be like the other ones, just full of wrecks for the most part. And abandoned bases and stuff like that. Uh, well, let's... How much... West... East. Yeah, okay, we'll, we'll head west. Oh, stop hitting P. My fingers are fat today. So what I should have done, because, you know, I'm a derp, and I left them up the base, I should have brought the water generators down here with me and thrown them down. In fact, it might be worth flying back for because it was so quick. I'm, I'm so close to the base from the planet, right? But Oh, come on. Reveal yourselves! What size planet was this? Oh, another four. Eh, every single planet was a four. <laughs> eh. be southeast because that just flipped to the east so it's probably over here somewhere oh yeah I see something what is that it looks like a wreck of some sort with a drone yeah do you say front okay well it's got some gear in it maybe a little bit of loot not much though not too concerned with with it. Oh, 243. Wow, I got really crappy range on this planet. Must have really heavy atmospheric density. Atmospheric density 2. Oh my god. No wonder. Okay, well, interesting. A little scorpion 
creatures around. I hate those things. So they live natively on this planet. Isn't that special? Gotta loot. Large plasma drones have potential. Yeah, plasma cannons. Exactly. Exactly. They're worth buku. Arrestrum's Ascosium. And always worth looting drones. Always worth looting drones. That's good. That's really good just put that right in here right away okay um, I'm not too interested in the crashed vessel I am specifically wanting some Zascosium and Arrestrium that's why I'm just kind of following the radar What's that? What is that? It looks very large. Let's get up over top of it. We'll suss it out here. Abandon mine. Hmm. Okay. Well. I don't really care about the abandoned mine. Should we take out the drones? Um, what kind of drones were they? Plasma drone, large plasma, yeah, 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 we take out the drones. Actually, let's just take them out really quick here. Because they're coming up on me. Really? Okay. Much easier than screwing around. And when you got a, you know, 10 stacks of magnesium. <laughs> okay. Where's those turrets? Oh, did they remove the turrets? Is there no turrets on this thing anymore? little sentry gun things in the no May, so just the ones below huh okay that's fine Well, I saw troops. Oh, those are just overlords. They natively spawn on this planet. Okay. So it's not, not necessarily a patrol. Nice. That, that actually makes a huge difference, finding that stuff. That's probably like 250 Zascosium and Arrestrium equivalent between those two pieces so it's a lot I'm not gonna worry about the mine I still need more restrooms Ascosium it's over here might be another abandoned structure the abandoned factory really no abandoned mine again abandoned mine again okay well I'll um, kill these drones
Uh oh. I pissed off the drone base. It's sending a troop transport after me. Oh, spotted a deposit. Okay. Let's get these things. Be come on. Before the troop transport appears. Nice. Awesome. <laughs> oh my god. That's that's a lot. That's that's like 500 of each Zaskosium and Arrestrian equivalent, I think, now. Holy crap, I could just keep shooting down large plasma drones here, maybe. I've got tons of ammo. Lots of food, and I can kill those guys for... Oh, I should be killing them for Pentaxid. Those overlords have Pentaxid on them. Actually, let's... Let's get away from where the troop transport's gonna show up. And we'll kill some overlords somewhere else, I guess. Really, I need to find... Okay, so let's make sure that I'm not just hallucinating, that I know that I can get... Hey. Hey, come back! See the troop transport, so Yep, they have refined pentaxid. Okay. That's what I figured. Good. Well, we know we can't get stuck on this sector then. If I lose all my pentaxid some how or another actually it, it seems that every sector has a way of of harvesting pentaxid so I would say the space travel thing is not going to be that big of an issue the warping around plus there's not a lot of sectors anyway Okay, we got another crash vehicle piece up here. And that looks like another large plasma drone. Perfect. Okay, the ammo is good too. The plasma charges can be deconstructed for Arrestrium ore, or the Arrestrium gel, I should say. Um, and that can be useful for other ammo types, like for some of the CV stuff, so. Which can be really freaking expensive on the Arrestrium to make. Ugh. Okay, we'll keep checking to see what we can find. Mm, is that a POI right there? No. Okay, let's go into night vision here. We'll be able to see a little bit better. I know it's all green and ugly, but... see what's over here oh it disappeared okay well I guess no 
worth it is magnesium don't need it but there is something down there that we might like large minigun three you know, I gotta keep my missiles just in case uh, just in case we run into the patrol vessel we want to have a full stack of missiles or rockets I should say okay What's that? What's going on there? A restroom. There we go. A large one. Really? Isn't that interesting? There's like 12 of them on the planet. Huh. Okay, I'm going to have to maybe dig a little bit of it and see how much I get for percentage-wise. So let's clear these guys out. Take care of them, and then uh, we'll just hand bomb a little bit of this after I loot these guys. And let's get back to. I mean the the alien planets do look cool. I'm just not a, a huge fan of all the uh, the really, really scary freaking scorpions. Lots of creepy noises in this forest. It's like a haunted forest. I'm going to turn this up so that you guys can hear it. Oh, I'm going to drop down. Oh, what? The noise completely goes away? Okay, what if I off a little bit? No? Land? And it goes away again? Okay, that's... I don't know what's going on. And the noise comes back. <laughs> How does that make any sense? Okay, so... <laughs> down for you guys I know it's a little <laughs> hellacious with the thrusters okay <sighs> weird okay let's loot this it's not a large plasma drone so it's I'm not gonna have super uber stuff on it um oh actually can I reach the other one I can Uh, let's get right over top of it. We've got something sniffing around us. This guy's sniffing around. Oh, uh, he's dead. He ain't sniffing around us no more. So let's get right over top of it. We'll level out. We'll come down a little bit more. No, I want to be up in the air. I don't want those stupid things getting to me. So we'll jump out. And we can see the ore underneath us. We'll hand bomb some of this here. I just want to see how much percentage. So we'll do like, okay. Let's try and get 10% and then we'll count how much we get. So... 
drill, grab my drill. Okay, so it looks like that one's the closest. Now I gotta keep an eye out for red arrows. That'll be the first indication that there's uh, an enemy vehicle of some sort, either troop transport, uh, patrol vessel, or a drone. Uh, Cause the red arrow should appear on my screen somewhere on the ed the corner of my, the edges of my screen somewhere before the red dot does. So got to be really hyper vigilant, keeping an eye out for red arrows. Wow. That was a nugget. Okay, that was a 10% nugget uh, at 190 arrest rooms. So that means I'm thinking this is going to be 1,900, which refined is almost 4,000 off one deposit. There's 12 of these. Oh, yeah, we're going to easily get the arrest room we need. Easy. Easy. Well, um... Excellent. So we found that. Uh, we know that the arrest room count is going to be really high, at least based on that one sample so far. Let's try and find some Zascosium now and try and get a, a size sampling from that. Because I, I really got to determine what I'm doing here in the way of vehicles. And, and I gotta figure out what kind of resources I have available to me. So if these are peeny little Zascosium deposits, I'm gonna have some issues. I'm gonna have to start just hunting drones. Maybe I'll have to come make a base here just to farm drones, which is really, which is really, eh, I, I don't know. Making a base to farm drones, just, Whoa, Snelly, what is that? That. Oh, that looks like one of those. Um, yeah, it's the, the ruined mine or whatever it is. Destroyed mining towers, yeah. Okay. Okay, so we have no more daylight. <sighs> Crap. Well, we didn't really succeed. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to. I'm going to start flying around. When I find something, I will come get you guys. Okay. I just backed off for a second because I just came across these guys protecting Zascosium. Now it says small, so that's a little concerning. I'm going to pop these guys. And we're going to go down and take a sample size. Okay. Let's go loot these guys real quick. Any nasty bugs around to spit at me? No, just the uh, just the little scorpion dudes. Okay, that's fine. Okay, hopefully we can get some more of the, um, the plasma, yes, <laughs> some of those. Oh, almost had it there. Okay. I haven't spotted the patrol vessel yet, so we should be 
good to take a sample size and then we'll head back to the base so I guess after we take the sample size I'll probably call it an episode it's not the fat the longest episode in the world but it's it is what it is <laughs> it'll be fine it'll be just fine so let's oops I turned off my braking obviously so I started floating away Uh, did I get that plasma drone over here? I think I missed one. Hmm, I did miss one. Okay. Okay, let's get this stuff put away here. We'll just... I'm just going to dump it all into here for now. I was going to take that to the trading station. I probably still will. I guess we can fill up our stuff. That's my food. We can do that too. Okay. Well, let's check out what this Ascosium small means whoa I did not mean to thrust down <laughs> max speed onto the ground oh, I see a few nuggets so at least that's promising that one looks almost shallow Dig up. So hopefully, I mean, even if we can get like 500 ore, which I don't think we're any gonna be able to, but even if we do, if we do, if we can find all the Zaskosium, I'll be able to pull Oh my god, really? Are you kidding? We're already at 10% with 10? This is going to be like 100 freaking ore. Are you kidding me? Uh, well, I might as well just dig it out then, right? That's all there is, if there's like 10 nuggets. Hmm. We'll see. We'll see. Let's grab this next one. We'll grab three nuggets. If it drops us to 70% at 30 um, Zaskosium, we know that uh, this is going to suck. I think this is it for Zaskosium. Realistically, to be able to get Zaskosium, I don't know if it exists anywhere else. Other than looting it. Well, I guess if that's the case, I'm going to need all of it. Oh, 38. That wasn't so bad. And now we're at 70%. So, so that's roughly 50. If we... Okay, so that's not too bad, actually. That's not too bad. That should be about a 173, maybe about three, a little over 300 ingots per if there's four of those that's 1200 at least that's something with the other stuff that we've gathered Ugh, it's still not going to be enough brutal 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 hmm. that means I'm going to have to modify, modify my thinking on on uh, what vehicle I'm going to be making or I might have to go into creative and strip a bunch of stuff off that requires Zaskosium. 
I might have to simplify some of its weaponry. Okay, well, I'm not going to bore you guys with the details of mining. Um, you know, it's pretty much straightforward. <laughs> That's all there is to it. So I'm going to leave the episode off here. We did get some. We've, we we are finding some now, so at least we can uh, we can at least like make the last drill on the CV and maybe a repair console for the repair bay that I'm going to throw on the base and and a repair station, stuff like that. Some basics that we can get built. So next episode, I think we'll have. Um, I think what we're going to do next episode is probably head back to Friggle and start infiltrating the our mission. We might do a slow infiltration on the mission. Uh, yeah, so uh, not guaranteed though. I, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see how the time is. We'll see. Um, I mean, I still got a few days before I have to even get the video done and another day or so to, to, to like edit and post it. So I still have plenty of time. Um, yeah, but I still think I should get started on it pretty quick because it might take forever. And I don't want to do a bunch of long ep or I don't want to do like two two hour episodes. I'd rather do like four half an hour episodes and uh, get it done that way. So until next episode, you guys have yourselves an awesome, awesome day.